Oh, hello, great readers. I'm Bo Chen. I'm Nimikum. I'm Van Chan. In this class, I'll read all of you a part of Ulysses. Bess. L. Ulysses. James Joyce. Sub. 1566. Would you like me perhaps to embrace you just for a fraction of a second? Mrs. Breen screams gaily though. You wreck. You ought to see yourself. Gloom for old sick sick. I only meant a square party. A mixed marriage mingling of our different little conjugals. You know I had a soft corner for you. Gloomily, twas I send you that valentine of the dear gazelle. Mrs. Breen Glorialis. You do look a holy show. Killing simply. She puts out her hand inquisitively. What were you hiding behind your back? Tell us. There's a deer. Gloom seizes her wrist with his free hand. Josie, Paul, that was. Prettiest dip in Dublin. How time flies by. Do you remember? Harking back in a retrospective arrangement. Old Christmas night. Georgina Simpson's housewarming while they were playing the Irving Bishop game. Finding the pin blindfold and thought reading. Subject. What is in this stuff box? Mrs. Breen, you wear the lion of the night with your serial comic recitation in you. Looked the part. You are always a favourite with the ladies. Bloom Squire of Dames. In dinner jacket with weighted silk facings. Blue Masonic badge in his buttonhole. Black bow and mother of pearl studs. A prismatic champagne glass tilted in his hand. Ladies and gentlemen, I give your island. Home and beauty. Mrs. Bean, the dew dead days beyond recall. Those old sweetsome. Bloom, meaningfully dropping his voice, I confess Auntie bought with curiosity to find out whether some person something is a little teapot at present. Mrs. Breen, gushingly, tremendously teapot. London's teapot and I'm simply teapot all over me. She rubs sides with him. After the parlour, mystery games and the crackers from the tree we sat on the staircase at him in. Under the mistletoe. To his company. Gloom, wearing a purple Napoleon hat with an amber halfman. His fingers and thumb passing slowly down to her soft moist meaty palm which she surrenders gently. The witching hour of night. I took the splinter out of this hand. Carefully. Slowly. Tenderly. As he slips on her finger ruby ring. Will side arm them one Mrs. Breen, in own a peace evening frock executed in midnight blue. A tinsel slip styled him on her brow with her dense card flung beside her mimblue satin. Slip out. Curves her palm softly. Breathing quickly. For glow in on. You are hot. 
you are scalding. The left hand nearest the heart. Gloom, when you made your present choice, they said it was beauty and the beast. I can never forgive you for that. His clenched fist at his brow. Think what it means. All you meant to me then. Horsey. When? It's breaking me. Dennis Breen. Whitel hat. With wisdom heli sandwich boards. Shuffles past them in carpet slippers. His dull beard twist out. Muttering to right and left. Off Brigan points cheering at the sandwich boards. You. Pee up. Mrs. Breen to Bloom High Jinx below stairs. She gives him the glad eye. Why didn't you kiss the spot to make it? Well. You wanted to. Bloom shirked Molly's best friend. Could you? Mrs. Breen, her pulpy tongue between her lips. Offers a pigeon kiss. Uh. The answer is a lemon. Have you a little present for me there? Bloom offendedly, kosher. A snack for supper. The home without potted meat is incomplete. I was at Lee. Mrs. Bunman Palmer. Trenchant exponent of Shakespeare. Unfortunately threw away the program. Rattling good place round there for pig's feet. Thale. Richie Gooding. Three ladies' hats pinned on his head. Appears weighted to one side by the black legal bag of collies and warden. Which is skull and crisp bones are painted in white lime wash. Richie best fellow and dub. Path advances with a tilted dish of possible in gravy, steak and kidney. Bottle of lager. Hee hee hee. Wait till I wait. Richie, good God. I'm very eight and all. With hanging head, he marches doggedly forward. Richie with a cry of pain. His hand to his back. Ah. Bryce. Vice. Bloom points to the navy, a spy. Don't attract attention. To be continued.